Welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we'll be exploring the cast of the classic series Happy Days. Let's discover their real names, ages, and see how they've transformed from then to now. If you enjoy it, don't forget to like and subscribe. Now, let's get started. Ron Howard, born March 1, 1954, stepped into the beloved role of Richie Cunningham at the age of 20 in 1974. His portrayal of the kind-hearted teenager resonated with audiences. Now 69, Howard has evolved into a successful filmmaker, producer, and actor. Meanwhile, Henry Winkler, born October 30, 1945, embraced the legendary role of Fonzie at 29, epitomizing cool in the series. Winkler, now 75, has excelled in various roles as an actor, director, producer, and author, leaving an enduring legacy in the entertainment world. Howard Cunningham, affectionately known as Mr. C, was a central character portrayed by actor Tom Bosley. Born on October 1, 1927, in Chicago, Illinois, USA, Tom was 47 years old when he played the role of Howard in 1974. In the series, Howard Cunningham was the kind and caring father figure, owner of the local hardware store, and a pillar of wisdom for his family and friends. Sadly, Tom Bosley passed away on October 19, 2010, at the age of 83. Marion Cunningham, portrayed by the talented actress Marion Ross, became a beloved maternal figure in 1974 when Ross, born on October 25, 1928, in Watertown, Minnesota, embraced the role at the age of 46. Ross's portrayal of Marion showcased a caring and nurturing mother within the Cunningham family, leaving a lasting impact. At 95, Marion Ross has enjoyed a successful career as an actress, contributing to the timeless charm of the iconic series. Ralph Malf, a memorable character, was portrayed by actor Donnie Most. Born on August 8, 1953, in Brooklyn, New York, USA, Donnie was around 21 years old when he played the role of Ralph in 1974. In the series, Ralph was Richie Cunningham's close friend and often served as the comic relief with his humorous antics. As of now, Donnie Most is 70 years old and has continued his career in acting, appearing in various TV shows and films, and occasionally working as a director and producer. Poxy Weber, the lovable character, was brought to life by actor Anson Williams, born on September 25, 1949, in Los Angeles, California. Williams, at the age of 25, portrayed Richie Cunningham's loyal and somewhat naive best friend in 1974. Beyond his acting prowess, Williams, now 74, has continued to diversify his career. Apart from acting and directing, he has successfully ventured into entrepreneurship, solidifying his role as a businessman and philanthropist, adding layers to his multifaceted career. Chachi Arcola, originally Charles Arcola, was a standout character depicted by actor Scott Bio. Born on September 22, 1960, in Brooklyn, New York, Bio was approximately 17 when he assumed the role of Chachi in 1977. Within the series, Chachi, Fonzie's cousin, evolved into Joni Cunningham's love interest. At present, Scott Bio, aged 63, persists in his acting career, contributing to numerous TV shows and films. Additionally, he has extended his influence behind the scenes, engaging in directing and producing roles, showcasing the depth of his involvement in the entertainment industry. Al Del Vecchio, a significant character, was brought to life by actor Al Molinero. Born on June 24, 1919, in Kenosha, Wisconsin, USA, Molinero was 55 years old during his portrayal of Al in the series. As the owner of Arnold's Drive-In, a beloved hangout for the main characters, 
Al was recognized for his humorous and endearing personality. Regrettably, Al Molinero passed away on October 30, 2015, at the impressive age of 96. Throughout his career, he garnered widespread admiration for his acting prowess and enduring contributions to the world of entertainment. Arnold, the owner of Arnold's Drive-In, was portrayed by actor Pat Morita. Born on June 28, 1932, in Isleton, California, USA, he was 43 years old when he played the role of Arnold in 1975. In the series, Arnold was a friendly and amiable character, always ready to serve delicious food and offer sage advice to the show's main characters. Sadly, Pat Morita passed away on November 24, 2005, at the age of 73. Throughout his career, he was well respected for his acting talent and is best known for his iconic role as Mr. Miyagi in the Karate Kid film series. Joni Cunningham, the younger sister of Richie Cunningham, was a prominent character portrayed by actress Erin Moran. Born on October 18, 1960, in Burbank, California, USA, Erin was 14 years old when she played the role of Joni in 1974. In the series, Joni was a sweet and vivacious teenager, often getting into humorous situations. Tragically, Erin Moran passed away on April 22, 2017, at the age of 56. She had a successful career as an actress, appearing in various TV shows and films throughout her life. Ted McGinley, born on May 30, 1958, in Newport Beach, California, USA, entered the Happy Days series at 22, portraying the character Roger Phillips in 1980. As a high school teacher romantically involved with Joni Cunningham, McGinley added a fresh dynamic to the show. Now, at 65, he remains active in his prosperous acting career, consistently contributing to various TV shows and films, solidifying his status as a familiar and respected figure in the entertainment industry. Jenny Pachalo was portrayed by actress Kathy Silvers. Born on May 27, 1961, in New York City, New York, USA, Kathy was 19 years old when she played the role of Jenny in the series. Jenny was the best friend of Joni Cunningham and became a recurring character known for her energetic and fun-loving personality. As of now, Kathy Silvers is 62 years old. She has continued her career in acting, making appearances in various TV shows and films, while also exploring writing and producing projects. Beatrice Cullen, born on January 10, 1948, in New York City, New York, USA, portrayed the lively Marcia Sims in the Happy Days series at the age of 26. As a close friend of Richie Cunningham, Marcia was known for her bubbly and fun personality. Tragically, Beatrice Cullen passed away on November 18, 1999, at the age of 51. Throughout her career, she made significant contributions to the entertainment industry, leaving behind a memorable legacy in various TV shows and films. Billy Warlock, born on March 26, 1961, in Gardena, California, USA, portrayed Flip Phillips in Happy Days during his early 20s. Flip was a member of the rival gang, the Demons, known for his cool and mischievous demeanor. Now at 62, Billy Warlock has sustained his acting career, making appearances in various TV shows and films, with noteworthy roles in soap operas and other television series. Heather Pfister was portrayed by actress Heather O'Rourke. She was born on December 27, 1975, in San Diego, California, USA. 
She was seven years old when she played the role of Heather Fister in the series. Heather Fister is a young girl who befriended Richie Cunningham and his friends. She appeared in one episode titled, A Woman Not Under the Influence, which aired in 1982. Tragically, Heather O'Rourke passed away on February 1, 1988, at the age of 12, due to complications from a medical condition. Tommy was portrayed by actor Kevin Rodney Sullivan. Kevin Rodney Sullivan was born on August 3, 1958, in Los Angeles, California, USA. He was 22 years old when he played the role of Tommy in the series. Tommy was a close friend of Richie Cunningham and appeared in several episodes, often adding humor and camaraderie to the group. As of now, Kevin Rodney Sullivan is 65 years old. He is now known for his successful career as a film director, writer, and producer. He has directed notable films and television shows, leaving a significant mark in the entertainment industry. Chuck Cunningham was portrayed by actor Gavin O'Herlihy. Gavin O'Herlihy was born on April 29, 1954, in Dublin, Ireland. He was 23 years old when he played the role of Chuck Cunningham in the series. Chuck was the older brother of Richie Cunningham and Joni Cunningham. He was a high school basketball player, but the character was eventually written off the show after the first season. Sadly, Gavin O'Herlihy passed away on September 15, 2021, at the age of 70. Wendy was portrayed by actress Misty Rowe. Misty Rowe was born on June 1, 1952, in Glendora, California, USA. She was in her early 20s when she played the role of Wendy in the series. Wendy was a waitress at Arnold's Drive-In, often interacting with the main characters and adding a bubbly and fun presence to the show. As of now, Misty Rowe is 71 years old. She has had a successful career as an actress, comedian, and singer with various TV and film credits to her name. Ed Peck, born on March 26, 1917, in New York City, USA, depicted police officer Kirk in Happy Days when he was in his late 50s. Portraying a stern yet fair law enforcement officer, Officer Kirk engaged frequently with central characters like Fonzie and the Cunningham family. Ed Peck's contribution to the series showcased his talent, adding depth to the show's portrayal of small-town life. Unfortunately, he passed away on September 12, 1992, at the age of 75, leaving behind a legacy marked by his memorable performances and contributions to the entertainment industry. Cotty, a character in Happy Days, was brought to life by actress Kathleen Marshall, born on December 16, 1967, in Los Angeles, California. At the age of seven in 1974, she portrayed Cotty, a friend of Joni Cunningham, making notable appearances in later seasons. Now 55 years old, Kathleen Marshall's early contribution to the series showcased her talent, leaving an indelible mark on the show's nostalgic portrayal of friendship and community in the 50s and 60s. Ashley Fister was portrayed by actress Linda Pearl. Linda Pearl was born on September 2, 1955, in Greenwich, Connecticut, USA. She was in her late teens when she played the role of Ashley Fister in the series. Ashley Fister was a love interest of Fonzie, Arthur Fonzarelli, and appeared in a few episodes during the later seasons of the show. Currently, Linda Pearl is 67 years old. She has continued her successful career in acting appearing in various TV shows, films, and stage productions, showcasing her talent and versatility as an actress.
Thanks for joining us on this fascinating journey through the Happy Days TV series cast. If you found it interesting, show some love with a thumbs up, and remember to subscribe for more amazing content.